Hello, I'm Dan Lyles with Lyles Insurance. In this video, I'm going to go over why you shouldn't buy auto insurance directly from an auto insurance company. Whether you shop online or by phone, buying auto insurance directly from a company is fast and convenient, but there are some shortcomings in doing so, and that's what this video is going to go over. There are three main reasons why buying insurance directly from a company is a bad idea. Number one, it bypasses the agent and they use a customer service rep instead. Agents, they have your best interest in mind where the customer service reps are told what to say by the company. And number two, if you have an accident, you want to get claims advice from your agent, not from a customer service rep who's going to, again, tell you exactly what the company wants them to tell you. This is really true with small minor accidents and accidents where you're not at fault. And number three, it's just not time efficient to quote with one company at a time. You can get a quote from an independent agent that'll get you a quote with multiple companies at once that greatly increases your chances of getting the best rate. I want to give you a general background about the difference between an independent agent and a customer service rep and also go over the difference between an independent agent and a captive agent. So first let me go over independent agent like myself, an independent agent sells insurance with multiple companies. So when you get an auto insurance quote with an independent agent, they're going to take your quote information and shop around with several companies at one time. That gives you the best chance of finding the lowest rate. And also it's the most time efficient as opposed to quoting with one company at a time. A captive agent, they only sell with one company and they're stuck with that company. They are direct employees of that company and while they give you better advice than a customer service rep does, they're still stuck with only being able to quote you once. And as far as a customer service rep, they get hired as an employee with one company, a direct company. They usually make hourly wages and everything they tell you is scripted from the company. So the responses you get aren't always in your best interest. They tell them what to say and those, those little bits of advice are more often than not in the company's best interest. I've made a quick reference chart here to help you go over the pros and cons of both types of agents and customer service reps. So just briefly look over that. It'll give you a good understanding of the difference between the three that I've been talking about. For those of you who live in Ohio, Indiana, Michigan, Pennsylvania, Virginia, or West Virginia, if you'd like to get an auto insurance quote, I will be happy to run one for you personally myself. I've left my quote information from my website one here, and I've also listed my phone number. You can go online, get a quote, or just give me a call. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.